Healing from osteoarthritis. Did you hear the word healing? It sounds impossible from what we hear from all of our medical authorities, but if you note, since antiquity, physicians have noticed that old age involves a drying out effect, water escaping from our bodies. And osteoarthritis viewed in this way is just another one of the many examples of the hunching, crunching, sagging, bagging, shriveling, shrinkling, wrinkling diseases. And until somebody helps you hold on to your water, nothing's going to heal. So let's delve into what osteoarthritis really is. It's a drying out process. To better appreciate this fact, visualize your spinal disc, your knee joints, and note that life is compressional. Your body is, has a miraculous design feature that's way underappreciated, apparently, in that unless you can create a sufficient electrical charge within your joints, where life is most compressional, water will escape each time you try to walk around, move around, do anything. So that this problem needs to be addressed before you can even hope to stabilize your loss of joint function. And if you stay committed, you can reverse it. Overripe fruit shrivels and wrinkles and loses its appeal for the same molecular reasons as your joints are drying out. It involves electrical charge. So simple osmosis says this is true. High electrically charged spaces attract water that oppose gravity. So when you try to move around in your compressional life, water can't escape. So you need to address what's happening to your electrical charges. Well, it turns out that only a few specific hormones activate your genetic program. What you need to appreciate here is what I don't see anybody talking about is your genetic program inheritance provides absolutely nothing until the right hormone arrives to talk to your genes to make new proteins. And the proteins also contain electrical charges and work with this other mysterious all wrinkle enhancing charge. So the hormones need to be right and this recreates the electrical charge and voila, if you stick with it, you'll get results. One cautionary note, I see way too many people diagnosed with osteoarthritis that also have a immunological component, in other words, an autoimmune component to their arthritis that's not been um, ascertained. You have to address that too. So the next time somebody tells you, oh, I'm sorry, take your pain medicine. If you're properly motivated you, and you want to get well, I'll help you. Good luck.